Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijutail Beading and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to make these beautiful large seed beads earrings. They're easy to make and I'm showing step by step and I'm sure with uh, these study instructions you will be able to make them. You need simple stuff, only two colors of seed beads and ear wires, nothing special, nothing difficult. If you want to support me and see more and more videos like this, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh beading ideas. And sometimes I make matching jewelries to the ones that I have already done. Uh, in this way you will be able to make beautiful sets for presents or for yourself. And you could also like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action. And if you make beautiful jewelries following my tutorials, please share them on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. I will be so happy to see your creations. Down there in description you will find a full list of materials, Amazon links where you could buy supplies from, link to my store and link for PayPal donations to develop this channel. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Now I will start with the list of the materials. Okay guys, what I'm going to use for this project are two colors of 11 seed beads. Here I use ear wires in this beautiful copper color. This is Nemo beading thread that is 0.2 millimeters, which is size D. This is size 10 beading needle and scissors and I'm going to put 1.8 meters of thread which is 6 feet of thread on my needle and I'll be back. Okay guys and I'm going to start by picking up 24 black beads. Okay and I have my 24 on my needle and I'm going to slide those down. I will stick my needle in my mat and here I want to make a knot. And I'm making my knot by making here a loop going twice through the loop I've made and pull. And then I'm going to make one more knot. Okay. And pull again. Now I have a circle of 24 beads and I will go through some beads in this direction and I'm going to take three black beads okay I will skip the next black one and go in the following Okay, then I'm going to take three more seed beads like this, skip the next black one that's on my way and go in the following. Okay. Then I will take three more seed beads, skip the next one that's on my way and go in the following. Okay guys. And in every row I'm going to be showing you only the first three steps that are going to be repeated until the end of this row. Okay. So add three beads, skip one and go in the next. Okay. I will do this off camera and I'll be back here to show you what's coming up next. Okay guys, and these are the last three beads that I'm adding from this row. Okay. Don't worry that it bends at this stage. It's not a problem at all. Okay. We'll fix it later. And now my goal is to exit out of this bead that's sticking out. Okay, and now what I want to take are two golden beads and I'm going in this bead that's sticking out. Again I say don't worry it bends and move. We'll fix it. Take two golden beads, go in the next one. Then again two goldens and go in the following bead that's sticking out. Okay, 
And now, guys, I told you that I will show you the first three steps, steps of every row. Continue this until the end of this row and I'll meet you here. Okay, guys, and here I'm adding the last three beads, two beads, sorry, from, from this row. Okay, now I'm exiting out of the next two golden beads and I'm taking three goldens and I'm going back in circle through these golden beads and now this is what I have. In my next step I'm going here in the next two golden beads take three goldens like this go back in circle through these two goldens and if you can in one movement go as far as you can in this direction and you, your goal is to exit out of the next two golden beads. And now I'm taking three goldens. I'm going back through these golden beads and exiting out of the next two goldens. Okay guys, and now I'm going to continue this until the end of this row and when I'm ready I'll meet you here to tell you what's coming up next. Okay guys and here I'm adding my last three beads from this row. I'm going back in circle here pulling and what I want to do next is go in this direction and I want to exit out of this seed bead here at the side. You see where my thread is and now I'm going to flip my work because it's easier for me to work in this direction as I'm right-handed and I'm going to take one black bead and I'm going here in this golden and I want to take three golden beads Okay, and I will go, I will skip this golden in the middle and I'm going here in this side golden. This golden that which is to one side. And when I pull, I have this. And I'm going to take one black, go here at this side. take three golden beads go here and I'm taking one black go here at the side and take three golden beads and go here in this golden take one black go here at this side golden bead Okay, and I'm going to continue this until the end of this row. Pause this video. If you're not sure how I'm doing it, rewind this. See these three steps and repeat them until the end of this row. And I'll meet you here in a while. Okay, guys, and I'm here where I'm adding my last three golden beads from this row. And my work is still bending at this stage. But I will fix this now in this row okay and what I want to do is go here through all of those beads I'm going in the central three golden beads like this and I want to take two black beads 
go here between these two goldens. Okay, like this. Then I'm going through these three top golden beads like this. And I take two black beads. And here I'm going in this golden. You see where? Above this black one. Okay. And you know what to do. Go through the top three goldens. Take two black beads. And go here between these two goldens at this side. Okay. And this row pretty much straightens up my work. Okay. I will show you one more time and let you do this until the end of this row. Okay. Okay, and continue this and I'll meet you here and tell you what's coming up next. Okay guys, and I'm adding my last two seed beads from this row. And now I will show you my second, my next row. Okay, in my next row, I'm going here in these two black beads that I just added in my previous row. And I'm going to take three black beads. Okay, and I will go back in circle through these two black beads. Like this. Okay, I have this. Then I'm going through these top golden beads. And I want to exit out of the next two black beads. Here what I want to take are three blacks again. And go back in circle through them. And my goal is to reach my next two black beads. Okay, now I want three black beads like this. And I'm going back through them. Okay, and I'm going to continue this until the end of this row and when I'm up to here I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next. Okay, and I'm just adding my last three beads from this row. Okay, now I have this and what I want to do is go here through these three top black beads. Okay like that and now I'm going to flip my work because I prefer to go in this direction okay and I'm taking one black bead and as I'm exiting from here I'm going in this golden then I will take one more black go here in this black one then through this one here take one black and go again through the golden one black go in this golden beads uh, in this black bead sorry then i'm going here in this black and I will take one more black and go through the golden and now guys I'm going to continue this until the end of this row and when I'm ready I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next okay guys and I'm here where I'm just adding my last 
black bead from this row and now I want to exiting out of this black bead that's sticking out the most and I want to take three golden beads and I'm going back in circle through this black one here okay like that then what I want to do is go through all of those beads and reach the next black bead that's sticking out okay I'm going through all of those beads here Okay, I'm exiting out of here and I will take three more golden beads like this, go back through this one and through as many beads as you can. Then I'm going through this golden and through all of those three black ones and I'm taking three golden beads and I'm going back here through all of those okay and now I'm going to continue this until the end of this row and when I'm up to here I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next. And I'm here guys where I'm just adding my last three beads from this row. And what I want to do is go back in circle through these beads here. Like that. And I'm exiting out of this top golden bead like this and now I'm taking this ear wire and I take one black bead I take the ear wire and I take one more black bead okay and I'm going back in circle through this one and now I'm going to reinforce it. Okay. And I pull. And now guys, I want to find a place and make a knot, okay? And in order to make a knot, I will choose a place, let's say here. Here, if you need, you should use your pliers. Okay, now here I will make a loop and I will go once and I will go twice through the loop I've made and I pull and then I will go in my following black bead I'm going to cut my thread and my earring will be ready Okay guys, and now my large elegant seed beads earrings are ready. So if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos twice a week. And you could also like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action. And if you make beautiful jewelry following my tutorials, please share them on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. I will be so happy to see your creations. Down there in description, you will find full list of materials, links to my store, link for PayPal donations to develop this channel and Amazon links where you could buy supplies from. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye from